So, I didn't know if I was going to announce this or if I was going to do a video, but I'm just going to go with and roll it. And I was thinking I, I'm i going to do some story, some story time videos. I see other YouTubers doing it. And for me, I remember a lot from my childhood to now. And sometimes I just get these flashbacks for no reason. I pray to God about it, <clears throat> and I haven't found my answer yet, but I will wait patiently for it, for these meanings of it. But hey, not all my memories are bad for what I remember. I remember all the good times I had, and I just want to talk about that, you know, do a story time video about that. This will be my first time doing a story time video, and I'm going to choose one particularly that I've remembered. But if this video gets... I don't know. If this video gets five likes, I'll be sure to do more after that. I just, I just want to set the benchmark right there. If if it does get five likes, I I'll keep going because I want to know if you guys are interested to see or to hear any of my stories that I went through or been through as a kid to now. If you guys are interested, so yeah, that's the benchmark. If we get five likes, I'll keep continuing, keep continuing doing more, and I. And before we get started, uh, thank you guys so much for the support, and let's get let's get right into this. So today's story it's going to be about me sword fighting my teacher with a ruler. Yeah, that that happened. So it was somewhere around fourth grade. It was after recess, like you know, elementary school. You'll have like a certain certain um certain like times that you'll get recess maybe if it's like early or in or even the afternoon or afternoon or if it's after lunch for my recess i remember no way it was in fourth grade it was fifth grade now i remembered it was fifth grade because i remember to have different teachers so it was fifth grade and i think it was the afternoon i wasn't really sure because i couldn't tell time correctly in elementary school. Kind of glad I, I uh, learn all my times now. But yeah, I, I remembered, I remembered I, I was one of those special kids that needed, needed help with uh, reading because I was really terrible at it and I don't know how to read. So there's this classroom, you know, like a classroom where you have all, all the students and the teachers in but there's a, another smaller room inside the building of where the classroom is. We have certain building, we have certain like um buildings for grade levels. So for kindergartners, um, they're like more outside to like you know to have recess like out outside the front door. I think second graders are the same thing. Third graders and fourth graders are like in these uh, hallways where inside, like when you go inside, there's an auditorium. Yeah, we have those certain types of, excuse, excuse me, buildings back in my elementary school. So anyways, so the building that I was in, so the building or the extra, that uh, the smaller room inside the classroom was just only me and a few other kids that needed help with reading and all that because I wasn't very good at it at all. I was like one of the few selected kids. And I remember there being like a long ruler. Like, I think it was, yeah, it was like a long ruler that has the one with the inches on, on, on the top side and the feet or foot on the bottom side or bottom of the ruler i can't talk right now so yeah and i remembered that in outside the classroom were other uh i'll just i'll just name it classroom one because that's where all the students are at so classroom one that's where my teacher i remember she had her a long ruler and she just plays like she just messes around with us she She's like a cool average teacher that, like, you know, if you don't do good, you'll get on her bad side. That, all that, that it's good to have those types of teachers because, you know, you'll get the more chillax ones when you do what they say. That's how you maintain to have a good teacher and possibly a favorite. So, anyways, um, so, anyways, back to what I was saying about recess. Uh, it was recess. I was playing, I think, football with my friends. 
I was a very, very hyper kid. I used to run so much. Nowadays, I don't run that much anymore because I don't, I don't go outside. I'm just over here making content for you guys. But yeah, I was a very hyper kid. I was, I was always the one kid that everybody wanted. Well, not everybody. I just happened to be the end up one on. And either or is to either one of anybody's teams, but people didn't admire me because I I, I was one of the top kids in, in my school that can run pretty pretty fast. But people don't admire that; they just admire like strength or whatever if people can actually catch. I was always like the short pass. You know, I'm always the one right next to the person with the ball. They can either toss at me, and I could go really fast. So it after that. So after that, you know, recess is over, and we get back to the classroom. Uh, the teacher opened the door. My teacher opened the door, and then I was the first one to get inside. And my cl and my classmate and my classmates and other two teachers. There's like three, two more fifth grade teachers besides the one I have. So we had three fifth grade teachers in total. So there, so the other two classes were getting back inside. So I was like thinking, oh wait, how about I just like go go to the classroom too, you know, which is the smaller class inside the building of the first classroom, to get the ruler and just sword fight my teacher with it. So that's why I I got I got I got my I got the I went to the second classroom, and then I found the ruler. It was a long one. That's what she said, <laughs> but um, yeah, I got out of the classroom. So I waited for every for I waited for all my classmates to like get inside and I'm wave and I, and I uh, yeah, and uh, my teacher came in. She had the yeah, she had the ruler with her. So I was like, Miss Ongar, and then we were just like hitting the rulers, and all my classmates were just looking at it, just fighting it it was the most funniest thing and coolest thing i ever did with the teacher like i i just pretended like i you know it was me of the times when people had swords we were just hitting our rules like we like if we're actually sword fighting it was actually the best one of the best moments i had in my life and i had fun enjoying that as a kid i i, I miss my i miss her i miss her now and all those moments that we have but yeah, but after that, like, she poked me, I think, somewhere in my, like, leg or my arm, maybe. And she was like, oh, who's next? Then my other classmates had a turn, and I and I had my turn again because, you know, I wanted I wanted that second second chance of redemption. But I, I lost again. And then she told me to put the ruler up, and I went back to the second class or classroom two and put back the ruler, and we just continue on our lesson from there. And yeah, that was the time I sword fighted my teacher with a ruler. It was pretty funny, and I had fun doing. And I had fun doing it. I really, I really enjoy that moment that I was laughing with my teacher because now yeah, some teachers are just eh. They're just eh. I don't know how to say anymore i don't want to be a disrespectful person and just say all teachers are bad they suck no so teachers teach however they want to teach they want to be truly respected just how all of us and yeah that's the end of my story time video uh let me know what you guys think about it if you guys just want to hear me whammer my mouth or if you got a couple of laughs or if you just you know just bored and you just want to listen to something but yeah, I thank you, everybody who has found my channel very entertaining and subscribed. I thank you for all that. And I share me if you guys want. If not, that's all good. And like I said in the starting of the video, if this video gets five likes, I'll keep continuing more. If you guys find if you guys find this one interesting, then give me those five likes and I'll keep going. But yeah, my name is Sandigus239, or Tornin, and I am signing out. Peace.